Sister Wives. Robin Brown gets rude awakening. Everyone must pull their weight. And what Cody Brown didn't reveal about the show. Also did Robin Brown disappear after fighting losing battle. I will explain everything. Watch this video until end. Hey lovely viewers. Welcome to my 2S gossip channel. Sister Wives star Robin Brown has fans wondering why she opts to take a different path than her co-wives. Finances are reportedly the number one problem for Cody Brown's family. Today, this is something the Sister Wives patriarch said time and again through the seasons. After the last season closed, he claimed he's losing sleep over it. Sister Wives, Mary Brown, Janelle and Christine busy making bucks. Each of the Sister Wives women seems to be trying to help. Mary Brown runs two lucrative businesses starting with the line of clothes she sells online. Then, of course, she owns a bed and breakfast as well, Lizzie's Heritage Inn. She also devised a way to bring in more by selling her slightly worn clothing with a hitch. That hitch involves where she wore the article of clothing. Either she wore it on the show, during an online sale, or in a social media post. Fans seem to love this. Then there's Janelle Brown who has several irons in the fire attempting to help her sister wives cash strapped family. Along with promoting products, Janelle offers cameo videos, which Christine Brown also does today. Christine sells clothing online, too, but she also promotes so many other products that her sister wives followers have asked her to stop the constant marketing push in her social media feed. Then there's Robin Brown, her online shop, My Sister Wife's Closet, still sits dormant and has been that way for a good year and a half. The last posted sale was back in March 2019. So, from where Sister Wives fans sit, it appears the wife who owns the most expensive home may be just along for the ride. With the other ladies, visibly scrambling online to generate funds, Robin is nowhere to be found. Mary, Janelle, and Christine do the majority of their money-generating gigs online. But Robin Brown hasn't said so much as, hello, on social media since the end of last season. But more importantly, Robin sits in a home valued at close to $1 million but doesn't have a job as far as fans can see. From what the Brown family said in the past, the adults pool their money to pay all the bills. So, Robin's business isn't generating money and the video below might explain why. In the video, Robin Brown heads one of the board meetings for the online closet biz and gets a rude awakening. It sounds as if Robin lightly reprimanded the other sister wives' spouses. But what happened next seemed to blindside Robin Brown. She told her co-wives and sister wives shared husband that some treat this as a hobby. She also suggests they aren't putting enough hours into this venture. Then they lower the boom on Robin Brown, who seems shocked. Cody tells her he doesn't treat this like a hobby because he'd enjoy a hobby. He doesn't like working with his sister wives and this virtual store makes him want to scream at times. Janelle seems concerned that Robin doesn't get it. While this online store could turn a profit, it won't support all four households. Because of this, Janelle needs to focus on her lucrative line of work, and so do Christine and Mary. At the time this sister wives episode filmed, Janelle sold real estate to bring in money. That is where she needs to concentrate, she tells the cameras. Sister Wives Spouse 3 Christine said she supports Robin by coming to these meetings and not rolling her eyes. But Christine also focused on selling real estate back then too. It seems that Robin Brown learned that this online shop was her contribution to the family finances. At first, she didn't seem to realize that and thought it was a family venture. But no, it is her job and they just offered support. It also appears this news upsets the fourth wife of the sister wives clan. So, her online store stayed open after this odd board meeting. But it didn't seem as if anyone made an aggressive effort to generate sales. So, did Robin Brown throw in the towel in retaliation for them not helping her? Sister wives celeb Cody Brown didn't open the door that eventually led to the TLC reality series for his family, as viewers surmised. Instead, it happened to one of his wives. The sister wives patriarch often made it sound as if he alone paved the way by bringing the suggestion to the family. But despite fans assuming the reality show was all Cody Brown's doing, he did have some help. Sister wives, Christine Brown not Cody Brown. 
It seems Cody Brown wasn't the sister wives adult initially approached with this offer of a road to reality fame. It was Christine Brown, who, at the time held a job as a spokesperson. For Principal Voices, she said, I became a spokesperson for our faith and I loved it. From the way the sister wives mom and wife describes this, she was a local media celebrity. Christine talked about polygamy both on the news and at colleges. Cody's third wife also describes her job back then as spending two years educating people on polygamy. Because she was so open about her family, she was approached several times about doing a documentary with her family. One day she happened to mention how documentary makers showed interest in their family to Cody Brown. The sister wife's husband asked Christine to tell him about this if it happens again. As fate would have it, shortly after Cody Brown's request to Christine, she was contacted again. This time a man named Tim Gibbons contacted her through Principal Voices. He was looking to do a reality show about a polygamous family. So Christine came home and told Cody and the leader of the sister wives family met. With this man, Christine believed that Cody saw how Tim seemed to understand the sister wives spouses and their mission. Their mission included educating the viewers on just how normal they are as a family. Cody contemplated doing the reality show with Tim at the helm because of what Tim envisioned. Apparently, Cody, as well as Christine felt this man understood how the family wanted to be portrayed. He understood that people ridiculed polygamy and also that it got a bad rap. Along with Tim's vision, he made promises about keeping their comfort at a decent level despite cameras around. He also vowed to respect their privacy by not airing anything they didn't want the public to see. From what Christine says in a book, the adults from Sister Wives penned years ago, Tim kept those promises. After Cody Brown became sold on the idea, the debate within the family started. Everyone did not welcome the idea of cameras following them around but eventually. It was a go. So, the cameras came to follow the Cody Brown brood. That was back in 2010 and the Sister Wives camera crew is still around the Browns in 2020. Before the show made it to the screen, the Sister Wives parents told their kids to let their friends know about their polygamous tribe. This way it would lessen the shock about the family's polygamous lifestyle. While the kids had a few close friends who already knew, Cody's children were pleasantly surprised when they told. The ones who had no idea. That's all except for one of the older kids. It seems one of Maddie Brown's friends mortified her with the questions she started asking. Once this friend found out Maddie's polygamous background she asked her if this means her father molests her. She also asked if this means she needs to marry an uncle. The friend of this sister wife's daughter also wanted to know if Maddie could wear the color red. Apparently this girl thought it was taboo. Maddie came home from school just horrified, according to Christine. Just think about it for a second. You know that a camera crew is coming and they not only expect to film you and your kids but inside your home as well. How does one get ready for this event? It sounds like Cody's wives scrambled. As far as the way Christine explains it, she needed to do some redecorating in her house. Then she had to worry about what she'd look like on camera. It wasn't easy getting things in order for Cody Brown's wives. It also wasn't easy to look comfortable while a camera crew documented every aspect of Cody Brown's life. Especially the interaction between him and his wives. Sister wives celeb Robin Brown disappeared at the end of last season, and it has to take some work on her part to stay out of the public eye. Cody Brown sightings are also rare. Still, the shared husband pops up in a photo now and then. But Robin Brown seems to do the impossible in a world where everyone has a camera constantly at the ready. Photos of the youngest sister wife's spouse seemed to stop as the last season came to an abrupt halt. Remember, last season ended with no, tell all, episode. Then Cody, with just two wives, said their final goodbyes for the season on the final couch segment. Sister wives, Robin Brown could never shake homewrecker tag. In a sister wives book, Robin tried to dispel a few rumors. That included writing about the homewrecker reputation she found herself saddled with online. Despite Robin's attempt to rid this myth a decade ago, it didn't work. Even today, you're apt to find a sister wife's discussion suggesting the last wife to join this family still turned the plural marriage upside down.
Some fans seem to think that some of the other co-wives problems stem from Robin Brown. Many viewers still think that Cody Brown favors his younger wife over the other wives. Despite Cody claiming that this is just not the case, wife. Number 4 just can't shake this fan assumption. Over a decade of being that homewrecker wife in the eyes of Sister Wives fans may take a toll on Robin Brown. So, maybe her recent disappearance has to do with her getting tired of defending herself to the fans. The blame for family problems still falls on Robin Brown today when it comes to the fans across social media. Many viewers who watched the recent Sister Wives season see the Flagstaff move as poor planning on Cody Brown's part. But Robin also gets some of the blame. The accusations regarding the fourth wife's part in this relocation surfaced not long after they announced the move. That's when Sister Wives followers discovered where Dayton Brown enrolled in college. Robin Brown's oldest child decided to attend a Flagstaff area college while the family still lived in Vegas. That's all it took, and Robin became the catalyst for the Flagstaff move in the eyes of some fans. They suddenly saw this move. About this sister wife's mom's need to be near her son. So not only is Robin accused of monopolizing her shared husband's time and affection, but she's now responsible for the family's move. It seems for this sister wife's mother and wife, it never stops. Maybe staying out of the pubic eye with this disappearing act gives this fourth wife a respite from this losing battle. It's possible that the sudden fame started Robin Brown off in a whirlwind. She joined the family just as the cameras came into their lives. But instead of sitting back and taking stock of the landscape, the fourth wife joined the sister wife's marriage and made a lot of noise. Cody, Mary Brown, Janelle Brown, and Christine Brown had a few decades together before Robin's entrance into their union. But during the interviews, this new Sister Wives lady seemed to answer things that were better left for a veteran of this marriage to answer. During Robin's early days in the family, the five sister wives in this marriage gave many interviews. But instead of letting one of the other wives, with years under their belt as Cody Brown's wife, answer the questions, she'd often jump in. Many fans took this as Robin attempting to take over the Sister Wives family. Even today, it seems to the fans that Cody's youngest wife acts as the spokesperson for the family at times. But is this the case, or are the fans seeing something else at work here? The possibility of editing should also be considered. It's possible only Robin's answer makes it to the screen via editing even though all four wives answered. This would give the impression to fans across the social media sites that Robin took over. Critics comment that Robin stepped into the role of Sister Wives Matriarch, the position Mary Brown once held. The suggestions about Robin Brown taking over are still alive and kicking today with the fans. But only because this is what they see on TLC's Sister Wives episodes. Maybe it isn't Robin but the editing to blame. But for whatever reason, the fans see her front and center and their comments address this, although not always in a nice way. After decades of fighting the critics, maybe Robin has just had enough, and she's tucked herself away until the new season rolls out. Instead of the fans' suggestions that she's hiding a pregnancy or sickness, just maybe her disappearance from the public is as simple as this. Thanks for watching this video. What do you think about this video told on comment box and subscribe our channel.